Hey everyone, everyone. Welcome, welcome back, back to, to Five Minute Eats. All right guys, today we have another international fruity beverage for you. This is the Demi Pais uh, Sour Sop Juice Drink with Pulp Guanabana Con Pulpa. Now this is a product of Vietnam, like bottled in Vietnam by a, a company that is from Honduras. And now based out of Miami. And based out of Miami. It's an so international delight. What exactly is going on? Don't really know. Now it says on here, shake well. Yes. So we're going to shake it. And just so you know, anytime a can says shake it, we shake it really well. If it's, All of our drinks are cold. Exactly. Because we always get complaints saying, you didn't drink it cold. It must have been room temperature. Now... Who does that? Only crazy people. We we have a fridge. <laughs> exactly. We have a fridge. It's really nice mm -hmm. and it's cold and we're shaking and shaking and shaking. And we have never met a Guanabana that we liked before. Exactly. So I'm not looking forward to this, but if you're new to our channel, basically we review every day grocery items. So before you spend your hard earned money, let us tell you if it's worth it. This is so thick like syrup. Now the pulp does look very small in here, like almost like fibers rather than big chunks. And it doesn't smell that great. It smells- It doesn't smell bad. To me, it smells sour. Slightly, but others have smelled like, like worse. So I think this is slightly better. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. All right guys, welcome back our rating system. Thumbs up, we buy it again. Thumbs down, we would not. So for me, this is a thumbs up. Big shocker here because the smell, to me, it smelled like spoiled milk, spoiled yogurt. Surprisingly though, taste-wise, and this is gonna drive me nuts because I've been thinking about it and thinking about it. I just don't know what it is, but it reminds me of something. This is surprisingly, when you poured it, it seemed like it was gonna be super thick mm -hmm. to drink. It wasn't, just a little. And it tasted pretty, you know, pretty good. It was just the right amount of sweetness. I would say this is probably the best soursop we've tried. Wow. Yeah. I think it's the only thumbs up for a soursop that you've tried. Yeah, this is really shocking. Hmm. Pretty good product. Okay. For me, it's going to be a thumbs up also. Number one, very, very surprised pleasantly that the pulp was not large chunks because every other soursop that has pulp in it is these big spongy cardboardy pieces of soursop and they're gross. They're just not a great texture. These are very fine little fibers of it. It's like almost non-existent. The texture on it is not nearly as thick as it looked whenever I was pouring it. The flavor, and now I'm not exactly sure what it is either, like what I would compare it to, but this I- This reminds me of something and it's driving me nuts. I kept thinking that it tasted like a yogurt, like a, like a sweet yogurt kind of flavor, because it does have a little bit of that tanginess of yogurt, but more so sweetness. And it does not taste like any other soursop that we've had because those are always a very distinct flavor and a not great flavor. Now, the only thing I will say though, this is a big can. Yes. Now, could I finish all of it? Absolutely not. That's a share size. Yeah, this is a share size. Mm -hmm. Maybe half I could do. Yes, me too. To sum it up, thumbs up, thumbs up. And if you guys buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.